In this question we have to decide under what density and pressure conditions does a real gas best estimate to an ideal gas. I wrote down the three conditions below and explained them briefly. Let's look at them one by one. The first condition is low pressure. Low pressure means that there are fewer particle collisions with the container walls, which also means that there are larger distances between the molecules in the container, which in turn means that since the particles are farther apart, the intermolecular forces between them are negligible. This is important because the kinetic model of an ideal gas assumes negligible intermolecular forces. The second condition is low density. Low density means larger volume, hence the molecules are farther apart, which again leads to negligible intermolecular forces. Finally, the third condition is high temperature. High temperature means that the molecules have large kinetic energies, which is important because the kinetic model of ideal gases assumes that the only energy of the gas comes from the kinetic energy of the particles. So in order for a real gas to estimate to an ideal gas, it has to have low pressure and low density. Hence the answer to this question is A.